to list jar contents, we need a jar first. So uh, let's do that with Zibi. It will create a jar file. And uh, now let's try to list the the contents. And uh, we need a jar, of course. And the jar uh, needs a file. And this is just a string. And the name is in ZBO uh, slash app jar. Jar. And let's do the try with resources. Jar file has to be jar file. And uh, in ZBO, there is such a file. And from command line, it will look, look like that. And app.jar. And this is the list. And let's see how it works programmatically. So jar, we need a stream. And this will be stream of jar entries. And uh, what we can do is we can ask the jar entry for the name. Entry. Get name. And then to list, we only need for each and system or actually out print line. And uh, why only out print line? Because it is already statically imported. So, and this basically it. So let's run the code uh, Java app jar, Java, and it works. And uh, what we can skip is this one because jar entry already ships with nicely overridden to string method.